Um, do 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 do. Walking around the store. All of a sudden, open, open, open. Bye. Oh shit. Here we go again. You flexing for a living, now here lying for free. Oh, you want the lifestyle? Who you trying to be? Don't you love it? Be you hated? Damn, I love it. Be you hated? Why you press? Why you mess? Let them hate you. Still the baddest. What's up? It's Ayani Mon. If you're new to my channel, hi. Welcome to the family. I'm extra energetic because I just got done dancing to boost my mood because I woke up late and was feeling like a bum. My first story time ever. These two pieces are bothering me so that they're not so bendy in the front. Ah. All right, well, whatever. At least they're bended the same way. I'm here with a story time video about the time I got racially profiled and attacked in the Chinese beauty supply. by the store owner, physically attacked. Boom, this is what happened. So one day I was getting my hair done. I was preparing to get my hair done by my friend Winstina. I was getting a high ponytail um, right after my class. So I have a car on campus. I go to Hampton University, by the way, just in case you guys didn't know. I decided to go to this beauty supply that I've never been to before. I was buying like the pack hair for my ponytail. I was gonna get like, I was really looking for the long 30 inch uh, packs, which they did have there. But I also started looking at lashes and other things like that. And then all of a sudden, I'm in there looking around like before I check out my hair because you know, I'm a fiend for lip gloss and lashes and all that. Um, do 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 do, walking around the store. All of a sudden, open, 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 like. Last lady that bought something, she walked out and left, and that was when he approached me. So it was nobody in the store. Mind you, the store is as big as this setup I have here. Like, one, two. The store was so small. I'm like, I don't have your stuff. Like, we're like, la 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 la. I think he's trying to steal my bag at first. We start saying, open, open. I don't. Okay, like, this is my, what are you doing? Is this, if you think somebody's stealing, is that how you approach them? When you're the store manager and you're trying to run a business? So we're going back and forth. Mind you, this is my Celine bag, which means it's a huge bag. I have my laptop in there and I have hair stuff in the fourth of you supply. Like, it was open, it wasn't zipped up. Nothing changed from the way I had it when I walked around the store from when I was about to go to the checkout. I wasn't even leaving, I was going to the checkout. I was going like this, I guess, he got a glimpse. I had got to be in there. I had pump it up and some wraps. And he's like, he's like, uh -huh. <laughs> like he saw something. Just imagine me in the store, telling him with this Chinese man, I can barely understand him. What are you doing? I don't need to steal from no beauty supply. I had a cart with like a whole bunch of lashes in it, y'all. Like I took it and smashed it against him, got him off of me. So once he got off of me, he went to the counter and he got on the phone. He like went back and went to the police. I'm like, oh, not like, cause I knew in that situation, if the police would've came and not based off of my call, I would've went to jail or something for that, for assault. After I got attacked, I went to another beauty supply and I went to Winstina's room and got my hair done. So what? What's also crazy about the situation is like, <laughs> when I went to the other beauty supply, I saw them on the phone and I was scared that the other Chinese guy from the other beauty supply was like down the street. I was scared that he like called them and was like, look out for this black girl with this blue bag, she stole from me. Because they were looking at me crazy when I came in and I was just like, oh shit, here we go again. That's my story about the time I was racially profiled and attacked. And I hope this doesn't happen to anyone. And if it does, I hope that you fight. Hope you don't fight enough to where you get arrested. But definitely stick up for yourself. Hope you like my story time. If you want to see more like that, just let me know in the comment section. Let me know if y'all have ever been racially profiled. <sighs> Next time somebody attacks me at the beauty supply, I'm vlogging, period. What you say? I'm going to turn on the camera. Bye. Thank you guys for watching my video. Hope you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one.